السلام علیکم ویورز ویلکم ٹو آئی یوٹیوب چینل اس یوٹیوب ویڈیو میں ہم یہ ڈسکس کریں گے کہ ہم کس طریقے سے راؤٹرز کو بٹوین سوئچز اینڈ پی سیز کنفگر کر سکتے ہیں سو لیٹس گیٹ اسٹارٹیڈ فرسٹ آف آل وی آر گون ٹو ہیو سم اینڈ ڈیوائسز ہیئر لائک دس وی ول ٹیک تھری پی سیز ہیئر اینڈ تھری پی سیز ہیئر آفٹر سیٹنگ اپ پی سیز اب ہم سوئچز لے کر آئیں گے وی ول سلیکٹ دس سوئچ اینڈ پلیس اٹ ہیئر Similarly here and then we will bring routers two routers will be brought here one is PT router here and the other one here Now we will make connections to develop We have a connection here Automatic connection will be developed here Like this Similar work is going to be done on the second side Now we will connect switches with the routers. Then the router with the another router. And then again router with the switch. Now all of these devices are connected with each other. But you can see here the link down here. Where we have the red color symbols present. So now we will do IP configuration for these connections. So first, we have as a note here, IP write down kar lete hain. Like for example, for this network, our IP is going to be 192.168.1.0 is right. Okay. Similarly, we have second side per kar lenge. After setting IPs on both the side, now I'm going to set IP for these two routers. 10.12.2.0 or 1.0, it's your own choice. Okay. We have set a and IP address here ok now اب ہم اس کو کیا کریں گے اب ہم ان کی configuration کریں گے different routers کے mode میں جا کر ٹھیک ہے ok so first let's go to each PC and set the IP here ہم یہاں پہ IP کیا لکھتے ہیں it's 192.168.1.2 ہم یہاں پہ gateway جو ہے نا router کے address کے لیے یہاں پہ 192.168 68.1.1 place कर देते हैं let's have it here okay same is the case with the second one we'll go to desktop IP configuration default gateway will be same for all but will be changed here जो IPv4 address है वो हम change करते जाएंगे gateway सब devices के लिए इधर same रहेगा okay same is the case with the last one IP configuration default gateway is again same but it is increasing as it moves here it's got 2, it's got 3 and now it's 4 now we have configured it here let's move to this side desktop IP configuration okay it's 2.2 as it is going to be 2.1 let's select it move to this PC desktop IP configuration this time it will be 3 and then here this time it will be 4 fine so we have done with all the pieces now we will move towards routers okay so now we are going to connect these two devices switch and router and this switch and router so what we are going to do is we will go to router then fast ethernet this is the first port and we will put the IP address that we kept here as the default gateway what we kept here was 192.168.1.1 Okay, now we will on it. Similarly, go here. Fast Ethernet 192.168.2.1. Switch on the port status, and that's it. You can see the connection is established between switch 1 and router 1. Here, router 0 and 0 are 
connected okay so now what we are going to do is we are going to establish connection between router 0 and router 1 abhi hum kis tarah se establish kar sakte hain aap router pt ye jo 0 first router hai hamara hum isme jayenge serial port and here we are going to put this address so let's enter the address 10.12.1. It will be 1, not 0. 1. Okay. Switch on it. And then go here. Same as the case here. Serial port 2. 10.12.1.2. Switch on it. And here the connection is established but we are not done yet because we are doing this process in RIP RIP stands for router information protocol so click on the router go to RIP add the addresses here this router should know we can see this one router let me show you this router should know with which network it is connected so we are going to add address here so the address is 192.168.1.0 as this is the address of this network we will add it and also we will add this address okay that is the second network address 10.12.1.0 and we are done here now we will move to second router RIP first network address is this that is 192.168.2.0 let's add it and the second network address is here this one 10.12.1.0 we're going to add it as well so let's verify that our connection is established or not Let's place this message here and here and you can see that the status is failed let's try again see this it also shows that it is failed it means there is some issue with the time elapse so let's set it let's go to serial it's your own choice you can select any like let's go with it okay and it is pre-selected here so let's check once again and you can see now it's successful okay so you have seen जब हम यहाँ PC0 से message send करते हैं towards PC3 it's successful then we send it from PC1 to PC4 it's successful and when we send it from PC2 to PC5, it's successful again after setting the time lapse. Okay, so what was the time for it? 64,000 and for router 1, it is 1200. Fine, it can be not set as well for some routers, but it doesn't matter if some issue is still occurring there, then just wait and try again. The issue will be resolved. We can also see the simulation. Let's check it. Click here on simulation and play it and we can see that all messages are being sent here like this okay so we have seen the simulation how it was working packets are moving from one pc to another if you're not clear let's see it once again and when message is placed here and it goes so this is the simulation it is telling you the time of delivery here and how it's being delivered from one port to another port now let's click on real time to move towards real time okay so this is a message being sent from here to any PC and you can see that it's successful 
okay so we are done with the IP configuration and now if you want to do HDLC configuration or check that whether HDLC is default configured on our routers or not let's go to command line interface okay now if you want to see let's click control Z now we are on default settings now let's go to global mode if we want to go to global mode what we do we write conf t but right now we don't need it why just because we want to check whether hdlc is default configured on it or not if it is not configured then we'll go to this mode i will show you later on so let's first check it out whether it is configured or not you will write show show ip integer let's write the name of the port that is serial 2 slash 0 and enter now this is some information that is being shown to us if you want to check the information about all the ports briefly let's write show ip integer brief so this is the brief information of all the ports that we have set up that yes it's okay method is manual and status is up okay for those ports that we have set it already jo humne set nahi ki definitely unke liye unassigned unset aa raha okay so it doesn't matter so let's check it out for the single port ki kya wo ye router jo hai configured hai ya nahi show end serial 2 by 0 aap s likh le ya serial complete likh le it doesn't matter so you can see here it is default configured here that is encapsulation hdlc fine in the case if it's not configured you will press enter you will go to conf t mode that is global mode then you want to go to another mode that is for configuring hdlc you will write end space serial 2 slash 0 now here you will type encapsulation hdlc i'm not doing enter because it is already configured on my router so it is not an issue for me okay but if it is not configured then you will configure it through this command let's check another router as well now for this router same procedure is going to be repeated go to cli command line interface mein aap yahan click karke isko control z click karenge na aap exit kar jayenge smart se ab aapne baki details check ki thi kis tarah ki thi let's repeat the process here humne pehle port simple jo hai details dekhi thi like show ip int serial 2 slash 0 हमने डिटेल्स देखी थी डिफरेंट डिटेल्स से की प्रेसिंग एंटर एंड ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन विल बी रिवील्ड हियर ऑल द डिटेल्स अब हम लोगों ने क्या करना है हमने चेक करना था तमाम पोर्ट्स के लिए तो हमने क्या किया था शो आईपी एंड ब्रीफ दैट इज फॉर ऑल द पोर्ट्स दैट वी हैव सेटेड अप ऑलरेडी अब हम चेक करना चाहते हैं पर्टिकुलरली एनकैप्सुलेशन एचडीएलसी किस राउटर के लिए हमारे राउटर वन के लिए ठीक है हम क्या करेंगे एस एच फॉर शो एंड सीरियल टू स्लैश जीरो एंड हेयर यू कैन सी वंस अगेन वी आर हैविंग इन कैप्सुलेशन एच डी एल सी इन केस अगर ऐसा नहीं है तो आप क्या करेंगे की प्रेसिंग एंटर नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू गो टू ग्लोबल मोर थ्रू कॉन फिगर सी ओ एन एफ स्पेस टी कमांड एंटर now we are in the global mode now we have to enter into the particular interface of the port so int s2 slash 0 and this is the particular mode we have entered in it and we have up encapsulation hdlc type karenge so ye aapka hdlc mode mein configure ho jayega if it is not default configured on your router okay so this was all for today. I hope that all your queries would have gone now. And um, like our videos, share it with your friends, subscribe our channel. And don't forget to give your feedback to us because it highly appreciates us. And wait for the other videos. Till then, Allah Hafiz.